Okay, welcome to Pokemon Black and this randomized hardcore Nuzlocke. It is episode 9, and we have everything on the team up to 35, plus everything in the box up to 34. So we got all of Momo, Clementine, B12, and Yumta up to 34, um, just so we have like good replacements if we need to change something up. B12 will come into the team at some point. We need the Psychic Typing, Solid Rock is a great ability, so B12 definitely will be in the team. Um, but for now, I just kept the team as is. Um, I don't think anything got any new moves, um, but everything's up to 35. I don't know which three we're gonna we're gonna use in the battle. Um, I nearly said lose there, which <laughs> doesn't feel like <laughs> doesn't feel like a good omen at all. Um, Clay is going to be 36, 36, 39, all fully evolved. Um, I mean, Zap has to come. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking Tino probably comes too. And then I guess it's a matter of like what, what best covers weaknesses there. So you, you look, you're gonna have ground, grass. You kind of cover grass pretty well. Pistachio covers grass really well. Um, electric, you're fine for, but you're even better for. But then if you and you're in the team, then you're quite bad. Or you're kind of completely necessary to deal with Grass. I don't think it's going to be Feltsroos. I think Feltsroos has been in every gym so far. I think we'll leave Feltsroos out. We might leave Kaviva out. It's probably going to be one of McGraw or Pistachio plus Tino and Zap. I think that's where I'm going to go with it. Um, but we're sticking with the current team for now. Um, no changes to be made. And, um, yeah, there's nothing to do except for continuing on. So let's head to the gym. Hello. I think this is a really long conversation. Clay, it's a pleasure to meet you. I am Getsis of Team Plasma. I've come to pick up my associates who are in your care. <laughs> do, like, towns and cities in Pokemon games not have, like, police stations or anything? Like, the gym leader <laughs> just takes in criminals who've been caught? I don't need no thanks now. <laughs> I can believe Watson. I don't need no thanks now. Your buddies were trying to steal some folks' Pokemon. What's this? It seems as if there has been some misunderstanding. We only free Pokemon from wicked people. Well, that sounds real nice if it's true. It's so bad. I may not... <laughs> it's the dialogue's also bad, which doesn't help. I may not talk, Purdy, but at least I'm an honest man. You talk <laughs> real nice, but what you're saying kind of sounds like lying. So tell me plain, what are you trying to say? Is this like a rap? <laughs> Is Clay rapping right now? Team Plasma also has an interest in Driftvale City, and we have many, many more members besides those who are here. Well, I can't tell if you're lying or not, but I reckon you've won this <laughs> without a fight. Oh, hmm, fine, take him again. A decision worthy of a businessman called the Minor King. Your grasp of the situation is outstanding. Well then, we will be taking our colleagues off your hands. Get this, thank you very much. Don't worry, my fellow servant of the king. We are two of the seven sages, are we not? Well then, everyone, I expect that we will meet again somewhere. Okay. Sorry to let Team Plasma go after you tracked him down, fellas. Say, why don't we cheer ourselves up with a Pokemon battle? Don't keep me waiting. What a, why does Charon not battle him? Well, we avoided a fight in the middle of the city anyway. Still, I can't help but think Getsis isn't just an ordinary person. I'm off to go make my Pokemon stronger. I really don't want to lose to that clay guy. Actually, I'm going to win my gym badge in a flawless victory. Okay, good luck. Um, yeah, I am a bit worried. If his team is good, and it, I mean, it's guaranteed fully evolved, so it very well could be, we might be in trouble. We, we have Zap. We have Zap, we have Tino. I th probably, I'm probably going to go McGraw, just because McGraw has Spore, and it's like a nice thing to have. Um, but either way, I, I mean, hopefully we don't lose anything. That's the main thing we're trying to avoid. Also, the game dying. Uh, we'll take the fresh water. I was going to say, so we don't have to leave the gym, but we're going to have to leave the gym at some point, just to uh, go from six Pokemon to three, uh, because we will be matching the gym leader. Um... Let me try and think of the way around here. I think you want to battle this, because, okay, so you're trying to get to there. I think this one goes down, yeah, I think, I think it's this one. 
And you go down. I, I know you don't have to battle like everyone in here. Okay, Challenger, bring it on. I shall. Um, I probably should have put Raikou up front. Well, I definitely should have put Raikou up front, but just because I don't think we're going to bring Kaviva in here. Um, so it's probably best to level up the Pokemon that we're actually going to use. Um, I may as well switch out. Just, I mean, I know it's Corefish, but just to be in for the next Pokemon. Like, I'm definitely going to use Raikou, so I may as well try to get a level for Raikou. Okay, Taunt is fine. I'm assuming this will be a one-shot. Um, like, the fact that we're only on par with gym trainers is slightly worrying. <laughs> but, um, I mean, Clay Clay might have, like, Ditto, uh, Smeargle, and... What, 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 uh, what else is bad and fully evolved? I, I do a whole thing on this. Love Disc. Um, it's not a great thing for it. Let's go Spark again. I mean, ideally, because at level 35, that's the last level where they're not guaranteed fully evolved. So, Author Wayne got quite unlucky there <laughs> with two level 35s and neither of them being fully evolved. Um, oh. <laughs> Sorry, Wayne. Uh, is this right? Yeah, I think I think we want to go down and then up. Okay, I think this is right. Um, yeah, Author Wayne got a bit unlucky there. I didn't switch again. That was maybe a mistake. Um, yeah. I, maybe I will bring Kaviva. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, this is perfect for Tino, at least. Um, oh, that's a good question. I've got to figure out who to bring, or who to lead off with, rather. I mean, again, my, my brain is telling me Tino, just because Spore, or Zap, because Zap is obviously our strongest team member. But that almost makes me want to lead off with whoever... I don't bring this one of those two, um, because my my actual decision making on lead off Pokemon has been truly horrendous. Uh, so I think I want to go down and then up on this one, and this takes me to the right place. There we go. Okay, I don't know why I remember this gym. Hello. I didn't do it again. I, I'm so dumb. Clay is at the bottom of the gym, but I will test to see you to see whether you're skilled. Okay. Ugh, missed, missed that right at the start. Um, we're being tested to see if we're skilled enough to battle Clay. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, it's probably going to be like a... Okay, so 36 is guaranteed fully evolved, and she has a Latias. Um, I wonder how this will actually reflect <laughs> Clay's team. Hopefully not well. Um, what do we have for Latias? Are you the best? Ice? You have Bite, which is quite good. Uh, let's go Pistachio, I guess. And um, this is level 36. This could be bad. Um, and well, not if he uses Water Sport. <laughs> Does Lassias really get Water Sport? We haven't changed m moveset, so it must. What a weird move for it to get. That is not great. Okay. Can we get a crit? I don't know if this, if this one shots. I assume it does not. Oh, it does. Okay. okay. I forget the pistachio is, like, actually really good. Well, now I need to actually pick, because that's the that's the bit down to the gym. I mean, it's basically a coin flip for me between pistachio and McGraw. These two are definitely coming. Tino and Zap are coming. Um, I mean, maybe it is Feldspruce. Does Feldspruce offer us... It doesn't help with, uh, not that one. It doesn't help with the ground weakness. Um, it, it helps against normal, but that doesn't really matter. I don't know. I don't think it is. I don't think it makes sense. I think it's got, McGraw has Spore and Bone Rag, but Bone Rag's not 100%, which kind of worries me. It does hit a lot, though. Do I care more about having ground or more about having ice? But it's it's ground and spore. Um, it's really a coin flip. I'm gonna lead off with whichever one I bring because it feels like the bad option, which means it's probably the right option. Um, I have no idea. 
Uh, Marowak offers a lot defensively, which is nice. Um, let's just put these two away for a second. And let me just look at their stats and see what, what is like more valuable to us. Because the defense thing can be big. So we didn't get any levels, which is rough. Uh, so you are our mixed attacker, which actually isn't something great. 68, 85. So 85, 72 on defense. You're actually, okay, no, you're way better. <laughs> Even Marowak's like good stat is barely better than your second worst stat, so. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go to Pistachio. I suppose we're gonna lead with Pistachio. <laughs> Which now I feel like is a mistake, but that is a good thing. We do want it to feel like a mistake. That was not what I meant to do. Um, because if I think it's a mistake, it's probably the right decision. Okay. Yeah, I mean, Pistachio definitely makes the least sense to lead off with, so it's probably the way to go. Uh, nope, not the bag. Do I need to change up held items? I don't think so. They should all... I mean, you have Mystic Water, which is still not very helpful. Okay, put you up front. And... Off we go. So, we are underleveled. And Clay is guaranteed to have a fully evolved team. So this could be bad. This could very easily be the end of the run. Um, but let's hope it's not. I mean, there are some fully evolved Pokemon that aren't good. But unfortunately, there are also some that are. As long as he doesn't have a Legendary. Legendary would be... I mean, we have a Legendary. Actually, if it's a Water-type Legendary, it's fine. If it's like Suicune, we're okay. Because Raikou can definitely take out Suicune. Um, but but if it's I don't know anything that Raikou is going to struggle with, we're gonna we're gonna have some issues. I don't know how you get like planning permission to build this gym. It feels questionable. <laughs> I'm not feeling good about this one at all. Um, I did put Pistachio up front, right? Oh, game is dying a death. Game. There we go. Um, yeah. <laughs> what what accuracy is Avalanche? Avalanche is 100. Just needed to check that. We also have Steel. Like, maybe that helps. We have Icicle Plate. Okay. Well, I think it's about time to see for myself what it is about your skills that made a gym leader like Elisa take such a shine to you. Okay. Show me what you got, Noel. Oh, I'm not feeling good. The The full team of Fully Evolved is okay. That suggests probably should have brought Marowak. <laughs> Marowak would have been good. Um, LGM would have been better. Do I just go... I'll, I'll just go 100% accurate. I'll go Ice... Oh. That's funny. Does he not use Swagger in this battle normally? Does one of his Pokemon not have Swagger in the, in the regular battle? Come on. Oh, this is a bad start. That's bad. Can't really afford to have this happen. You need to hit this. If you miss this, we've probably lost, okay. That might do a lot, considering we've got Swagger. Good stuff, okay. So, B-Barrel, we're gonna switch. Just cause Swagger is still up and I'm worried about it. B-Barrel is not too bad, B-Barrel is like, a very manageable, fully evolved Pokemon. I think. Amnesia. I just need to pay attention to what this does, because I always forget which stats are going up. Okay, let's go Spark. This probably one shot. Actually, it might not. Okay. But the parallel. Okay, we're good. Oh, that's a bit annoying. This has gone, like, exceptionally well, though. Uh, well, we're going to outspeed anyway. We could quick attack, but what if you use a hyper potion? I've kind of okay. See, I'm learning. I feel like I kept forgetting that hyper potions existed in the earlier gym battles. Uh, can we get a crit? We don't really need it, to be honest. It's fine. Are you gonna hyper potion again? Hopefully. If you've got another one, okay, that's perfect. If you've got them, just use them on B barrel. <laughs> that's like the perfect place for us to have them. That's fine. You know, three, right? Okay, that's even better. That went perfectly. That could not have gone any better. Yes, we're paralyzed, but that 
Virtu oh god, it was a test! Oh my god! It really was a test! <laughs> to see if we were ready for the gym leader. Clay's got a Latios. We have Bite. This could be bad. This could be really bad. <laughs> uh, we do have Bite. We kind of need this to do a lot. Uh. Okay. It's a bit worrying. We still have... Oh. <laughs> Was that a crit? What happened there? Oh, you have pistachio as well. We, I wasn't below half health there, was I? I don't think I was. Was I? That didn't say crit. What just happened? Did our special defense drop? That's rough. Um, did not want to lose Zap. You have ice, but you have spore. You don't really have any attacks. So I guess we're going to have to go to pistachio. I probably should have gone Spore and then go to Pistachio. In fact, I definitely should have done that. This was a mistake. We need to take a hit. Okay, that's fine. God, that would have been a great turn to switch. Okay, we live a Luster Pro. Do we? I don't know. <laughs> now I'm doubting myself. Yeah, I, I counted it. It's fine. I knew that. Oh my god. Imagine we hadn't wasted, I mean, in that sense it kind of didn't matter because we knocked it out before it got to red health, but imagine we hadn't wasted, the, oh, that is nice, we hadn't wasted the uh, hyper potions. Imagine we had to deal with like six hyper potions on the Latios. Oh, I'm, I, I'm going to look back in editing and be like, Raikou was probably on like 30 HP. I don't think it was below half health. But it might have been. Maybe I just wasn't paying. I mean, I wasn't paying attention because I can't tell you where its health was at. Murph. I see, but I sure don't like it. For such a young'un, you have an imposing battle style. I know you got people who can dig up your potential. Murph. Here, take this. Oh, right. Oh, oh that's so bad. I mean, that was a tough team. Having Latios as the ace... Not ideal for us. So, this is your fifth batch, huh? If that's so, Pokemon up to level 60 will obey you. Also, I'll give you this TM. Well, that was the plan, but I just want remembered... What? <laughs> I just added the word. Want. Well, that was the plan, but I just remember there's something I want. Oh, because he's... Okay. Wait in front of the cave at the end of Route 6, would you? I will. Um, that is rough. Oh, God, I mean... Maybe it was too easy with a legendary. I mean, it wasn't. <laughs> but in theory, maybe that's what I was thinking. I thought it was too easy with with Raikou. So I thought, you know, let's lose Raikou. Um, that also takes away, like, <laughs> a big part of our team in terms of typing. Like, we can't add Yumtai in. That's just another water type. We can't really add Momo in because that's another... I guess we have to add in LGM. But LGM is not really great right now. Um, okay, let's go. So on this PC, let us deposit. Raiko, I'm sorry, Raiko. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> that was so bad. I don't, I don't know. I mean, you know, and I will know once I'm editing this, what happened there. I, I, I think it was maybe a special defense drop. Or does Lust Approach get more powerful than more? I don't think it does. I think it's 70 power. Um, okay, so let's get you back in. Let's get you back. So we do have this big fighting weakness, so I suppose it makes... I mean, Clementine does resist a lot of that. Um, but for now, I think LGM makes sense. Uh, so we'll grab LGM. And we'll just move these, because that's going to annoy me otherwise. Okay. I'm glad I leveled these Pokemon up, at least. Okay. Uh, let's heal, also. Um, we'll probably get to the Charged Stone Cave encounter. I, I have zero idea how long I've been going. Um, did not pay attention. Maybe 15 minutes, maybe not even 15 minutes. So we, we should have time. Okay. That was bad. 
Um, I also, I figured out who Charles was. Um, Charles was the guy who showed me rotation battles. And in white, shows triple battles. Um, he's over here. The guy on the bridge was like, oh, I think of the cold storage and Charles. This is Charles. Hey, Charles. I'm a heartbreaker. My name, Charles. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, I, that's good. I just remembered there was actually the battle with Bianca here, isn't there? Um, that is a good thing to remember. I, I genuinely hadn't thought of that until I was about to step out into it. Um, you actually have to battle Bianca here. Um, so let's lead with... Let's lead with Tino. Tino feels safe. Did I even use Tino there? I don't think I did. Okay. Do you? Oh, you do. Okay. Oh, hi, FJ! Yeah, because this is where you get Fly. Which we cannot use at all. Hey, were you at the gym just now? Oh, hey, that's Jif Drift Vale's gym badge! Oh, that's totally cool! That's amazing! Thank you. No, 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 I can't get distracted being all impressed with your shiny new badge! I'm also a trainer. At times like this, you battle, right? Yeah. Um, her starter won't have changed because she has Pidgeot, so in the last battle with Charon, we had the evolution, but um, for her, it's already fully evolved. Zangoose. Who did I start with? Zangoose is always scary. I feel like Zangoose has such high attack, and it's also pretty fast, and it's got Slash, so it's just like always scary to me. Let's use an embargo, in which case we're probably fine. Um, I, j I just always assume it's going to use Slash and it's going to get a crit. That's just like where I'm at with Zangoose. Uh, let's go Sludge Wave. think that... Two shots? I don't get one shots. It'll do 61%-ish. Okay, I don't know where I cut away there because the game was sort of dying a bit. Um, if you missed the end of the Zangoose bit, I knocked out Zangoose with a second Sludge Wave. And uh, Jellicent is her second Pokemon. Also, don't know why I went for that. It's Water Ghost. No idea why I went for that. Uh, we will put it back to sleep. It's mostly because we don't have Raikou anymore. And obviously my usual switch here would be Raikou. And now I just don't know what to do. <laughs> we don't have any other electric type moves. We don't really have any moves for this thing. Because Raikou also had Bite. So I guess, like, Feldspruce has Faint Attack. But obviously that's no good. God, we are horrendously set up for this thing. You're weak to Ghost. You have no super effective attack. Actually, you only have not very effective. Oh, no. Wait. Wait, wait. We have Scrappy. Do we have Scrappy? We have Scrappy. <laughs> it's not great, but, but it might be the best we can do because I don't... You're weak to Ghost. You're weak to Water. You're weak to Water. You only have Fire Punch. And you only have Ice and Steel. So, yeah, we're not in great shape. Okay. Um, Jellicent is down to struggle. <laughs> so we seem to have made it. Um, I I exhausted all of my PP for headbutts and uh, strength. But we got there. Oh my god. I was using speed up, by the way, which is why that only took however long it took. Um, that was, I mean, 30, 41 plus another 20 turns. In other, that was like 60 or 70 turns that took. Um, another ghost, so I guess I'll stay in. <laughs> I mean, Kaviva is great. Kaviva's not leaving this team unless something dreadful happens. Okay, that's kind of good for us. Because uh, I'm instantly going to... Does that happen first turn now? I don't feel like that used to happen first turn. You immediately take quarter damage? Um, so what are you going to go for? I guess I have no idea. Um, I can't go into B12. That's too scary. So we'll go to Pistachio. I assume you're going to go for... Wait, what just happened? Oh, Pursuit? Was that Pursuit? I see that was Pursuit. I wasn't paying attention. I don't know if any other move does that, so I'm guessing it was Pursuit. Uh, that's fine. Let's go Avalanche. Well, this misses, and we should be good there. There we go. Uh, I think we're okay here. We just have Pidgeot left. Okay, yeah. So this was a long battle. Um, But, but it has been successful. I really have no idea how long I've been recording for now, because God knows how much of this is going to get cut out. Um, we're probably just going to go to Charge Stone, get the encounter, and call it an episode. Um, which I think will be about a good length. I have no idea. I haven't had a Pokemon battle with you in a while, FJ. You've become totally strong, huh? I'm not that strong, so I don't know how to say it, but I think you're way tuned into how your Pokemon feel. 
Oh, you know what? I want to share this HM with you, FJ. Thank you. Okay, I mean, I'll check if someone can learn it. Um, it'd be nice to be able to jump between places, but I, it's not totally necessary. My papa gave it to me after he tried to make me take me home that time. I'm sure it's so I can come home anytime he wants, though. That's so appropriate. Because she has a Pidgeot? It actually makes sense in this. Oh, hey, I have to share this with Charon, too. See you, FJ. Bye-bye. Bye. Um, can anything learn it out of interest? Uh, where are we? Fly? Yeah, no. Uh, something in the box might be able to. Um, we don't have any flying types, though, so... Maybe we'll get one in Charlestone Cave. You know? Okay. Uh, nothing died there. Which I'm taking as a win at this point. <laughs> <laughs> that felt like something was going to die. Um, I'm so happy that Kaviva has dry skin. So maybe Water Ghost isn't an issue. Maybe I just need to get Thunder Punch? I wonder if... I mean, it's like a 25% chance, so it's it's completely random. But I wonder if Kaviva can learn Thunder Punch? Because that would help us quite a bit. Uh, can I have... A Super Repel? Okay, I battle all the trainers on this route, so this should not uh, take very long, because I need the experience. Um, I didn't... I don't think there is another encounter until you get to Charlestone Cave, so... And I'd already had the encounter. Um, uh, I didn't get these items for some reason. We have... Choice Band! <laughs> That's nice. After I missed out on the Choice Scarf because the game crashed. That's nice. I feel like I've been, like, reimbursed with a Choice Item. And probably a better Choice Item. That is really good for, I mean, probably Kaviva. Uh, that is nice. Um, I don't think we have to do anything. We just go up here. Thanks for waiting. You're welcome. Hello. Looks like the nest of an electric type Pokemon called Galvantula. Don't know why there's a nest here, but if there's if there are folks, ha it's the number of apostrophes that makes it difficult to read for some reason. But if there are folks having problems, the gym leader's the one to fix it. Crocorock, take it out. Why don't you use your Lassios? Or oh, we're gonna get to see up. Imagine he gives us Thunder Punch. <laughs> That'd be so helpful. And this here TM's yours. It's my favorite TM, so you can teach it to all your Pokemon. Ominous Wind. That's weird. <laughs> That's also kind of appropriate. Um, I will check for sure. It's called Bulldoze. No, it's not. You're lying to me. Um, but that is nice. Oh, sorry. Do things how you want. Decide your own limits. Okay. Bye. Um, can anything learn Ominous Wind? I do like Ominous Wind. Uh, where are we? Can we have something that learns this? McGraw is the one that you really don't want. <laughs> I mean, like... Well, no, we have three physical attackers, actually, and three special. Well, Miss Pistachio's mixed, so we're more likely to not have something. Uh, that's fine. Let's put McGraw up front. Actually, I think... You don't have to battle N. I think N is in here. I don't think you have to battle him, though. I think you battle N at the end. I get confused between black and black and white, too. No, we don't. you don't battle him here. Uh, that's an appropriate time for Repel to wear off. Hello. Come. Okay. My lord Ed, we brought the one you wanted. Bye-bye. Ah, yes, that was the Shadow Triad just now. Getz enlisted them in Team Plasma. Apparently, they were the ones who prepared the Galvantula Nest at the cave entrance. Chargestone Cave, I like this place. Formulas express electricity and its connection to Pokémon. If people did not exist, this would be an ideal place. Yeah, sure. Of course, such news should be a surprise. I told Getz about you and your friends. After I did, he apparently used the Shadow Triad to find out about you. Charon is pursuing the ideal of strength. Poor Bianca has faced the sad truth that not everyone can become stronger. And you are not swayed either way, more of a neutral presence. Which is apparently a good thing. Team Plasma will be waiting for you ahead. Getsis wants to see what kind of Pokemon trainer you really are, but it's you. Okay. I guess, we oh, there's also Team Plasma in here. Okay, well, we have our encounter. Um, and then we should be good. Something good, please. Oh, no, no, we have Wigglytuff. Okay. Oh, God. I really did not want this for my encounter. Um, we have Wigglytuff. It's dupes. 
Whew. <laughs> I really didn't want another normal type. I love normal types. Not now. We really need... Electric type would be nice, given where we are. That's also... Was it even this run? <laughs> I get it in so many runs that I'm confused. Yeah, it was. But it's also dupes. Um, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. I Charon, Charon killed... Uh, not ears? Uh, Blair. There we go. I remembered. <laughs> I get them in so often. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'd rather have the Iggly buff. Oh, Wobbuffet is so bad. That's fine. Dusk Ball should do it from there. I don't know what this thing's catch rate is, but I'm going to say 45. If I don't know, it's it's usually 45. Um, I don't know. I'm like I'm desperately trying to think what ability this could have. If it's not Wonder Guard, that's going to make it like incredible. Um. I, okay, well, let's see. It desperately tries to keep its black tail hidden. It is said to be proof the tail hides a secret. Okay, I mean, that makes it more interesting to me. Um. I mean, honestly, I kind of like the name Blacktail, so this is going to be Blacktail the Wobbuffet. Um, let, let's go and check the ability, I guess, before we end. I'll probably do Charge Stone Cave off screen and then like start the next episode with the end because I think you battle end at the end right so we might start the next episode with the end battle don't give me something good now don't don't oh I mean it's a normal type but I would have preferred that <laughs> it would have been like at least a nice replacement if we'd lost Kaviva or something okay that's fine oh it's so annoying maybe, maybe no it's gonna have a great ability it's it's got to I refuse to believe it. It doesn't have an amazing ability. Uh, let's throw up a super repel, which I do have. Uh, like I, I'm like blanking on what it could even have to make it good. I just don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it could possibly have. Like it doesn't have a weather thing, which is fine. That wouldn't make it good. It doesn't have wonder guard. Doesn't have a trap. Oh, it could have a trapping ability. Maybe it kept its ability. We didn't try to run. No, I think it would have popped up at the start if it had a trap. It doesn't have intimidate, which would have been like nice. That would have actually been useful. Um, I still haven't caught anything with intimidate, which is weird. Okay. Let us see. Rain dish. That's maybe not terrible. I mean. If it could learn Rain Dance. <laughs> like, maybe it's use Its defense is really bad. I thought it had good defenses. It just has obscene HP. I thought it had good defenses as well. I mean, they're okay. No, they're not, actually. You're level 24. They're, they're, they're all right. Um, Relic Copper is one of those super high sale items, right? Um... <laughs> I mean, maybe if we get the TM for rain for rain dance and it can learn it, it will become usable. Um, but I'm I'm definitely not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not going to level it up um, in anticipation of using it. I mean, it's been it's been an okay episode. I think we did all right. We didn't lose the run, which is a start. Um, and, and at this point, I'm kind of happy to just accept that. We didn't lose the run. We only lost one Pokemon. It was probably our best Pokemon. But we still have our starter and our second Pokemon. No. <laughs> our third Pokemon. Fourth Pokemon? Wherever Dream Yard was. Uh, that Pokemon. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back next week. Again, I'll probably do Charge Stone Cave off screen. And start with the end battle. Just because it's probably going to be a whole episode otherwise. We could do it. I'll see. Uh, either way, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next week. Uh, yeah, goodbye.